my neighbor's dog. Stop! Hi guys, welcome to my channel and thank you so much for stopping by. So today I'm going to share with you my Sephora haul. I have gathered all the products in this bag. Well, I do not have all the products with me because some of my packages are still on the way. They got delayed in transit. So that is frustrating. I just could not wait. Okay, I had to film this video. I had to post it uh, by today. So yeah, if you are interested to know, then please keep on watching. Before I begin, please take a moment to subscribe to my channel because I am fun, you will enjoy my videos and I will really appreciate it. So let's just get I had to place a lot of online orders like ever since I moved to DC, I rarely visit a Sephora store because the Sephora store that is the nearest one is literally 5.6 mile away from where I live and they do not have any parking spot, they do not have even like roadside parking so it is pretty inconvenient for me. So I placed a lot of online orders and this time I don't know what happened like all my products got delayed so I'm hoping to get them pretty soon. Let me just quickly go through all the products that I still do not have with me. If I get them by the time I finish editing, I will chip them in. So I got this Too Faced Chocolate Sole Melting Bronzing uh, and Sculpting Stick. Ever since they released the picture on their uh, Instagram page, I have been dying to try it out. And I got the shade Chocolate Caramel. It retails for 35 US dollars. Stay tuned because a review is coming up pretty soon. And next I got this Face Bond Foundation from Urban decay like everybody is going gaga over this foundation i had to get one for myself and i got the shade 19 olive uh golden like number 19 and urban decay products like their base products they never ever disappoint me so i'm super duper excited to try that one out next i got my charlotte tilbury airbrush flawless foundation in the shade 8w i tried a smaller size like a sample size of that foundation but i never ever like got the full size and this time i just decided to get one because i moved to dc and it gets pretty warm in here during the summer time so i needed something mattifying and long lasting so i am super excited to try that one out as well let's try that again next uh rare beauty soft pinch luminous powder blush i got the shade love i have um the liquid one of that one so i am super super excited to try that one now the day when i went to the store i actually swatched it and that one like i feel like these blushes are super duper shimmery for my test i love a glowy blush but these are like way too shimmery for my test so i skipped that one and then i saw a couple of people like raving about these blushes and i was like am i missing out something i need to try this so i placed an online order it should be here soon i am definitely going to do a testing new sephora makeup video pretty soon so please stay i here. spent a fortune on my foundation and i got this la mer foundation i know it's 150 dollars but i had to try it out like i saw tati she always raves about this foundation and i just gave in and i picked this one up i'm definitely going to do a review and i'm definitely going to share with you my thoughts and this is how it looks like honestly it's giving luxe it's a luxurious product and the packaging is giving luxe i got the shade 330 with this foundation i hope it matches me so yeah please stay tuned i am going to definitely post a review please. another complexion product that i have been eyeing on for a really long time and this is my gulan terracotta latent i hope i am saying it right and this is the shade 3.5 w let me just open it up so here is how the bottle looks like again it, it's lux it's giving lux i uh, saw shri are reviewing it on her instagram and i instantly decided to get it and it's here i'm super super excited to try it out as well and then i got this hourglass concealer and this is their airbrush vanish concealer i got the shade beach number six beach and 
I think was it Jacqueline Hill who was talking about this concealer and I have heard so many good things about this concealer and I needed to try it out for myself so yeah I am really happy with this purchase. This concealer has taken the internet by storm and everybody raves about it so I needed to get one for myself and this is how the concealer looks like. Fenty Beauty is now available on Nykaa India's website so if you are from India you can get Fenty from Nykaa so I am definitely going to post a review so please stay. Next I picked up this faux filter color corrector from Huda Beauty in the shade peach. Now I have Hemia's dark circles. I can use all the helps that I can get okay and I love color characters. I just have so many color characters in my collection. I wanted to finish some of them up before buying another one and this was the time my friend. This was the time. So I picked this one up and this is how it looks like. I have already used it a couple of times. So far so good. I am liking it but stay tuned for my update on this product. Like it's too early to say and to pick up these blushes from house labs these are their new uh like shade this is the shade french rosette rosette you know what i mean so this is how the blush looks like hey, look at the packaging it's super cute and the packaging is actually color coated i just love the packaging so much and this is how the blush looks like don't you think it is the perfect like dusty burnt peach shade for my skin tone. I am probably the one who has not tried these blushes yet. So this is for the first time I will be trying out this blush formula. And you guys probably know I am a blush fanatic. So I am super duper excited to try this one Next out. I picked up another viral product. This one from Patrick Star's line. One size beauty. Like it is a viral product. Okay. Everybody goes gaga over it. It is basically hair spray for your makeup and it is supposed to make your makeup last all day all night until you decide to take it off so i needed to try it out and this viral like transfer proof lipstick trend is going viral and i needed to try that out as well i picked up the smaller size because it contains alcohol and i have super dry skin so before committing to the bigger size i just decided to get the smaller one uh if i like it i will definitely go ahead and buy the bigger size during the next sale or you know i will just go ahead and buy the big size so i'm super duper excited to try this one out and i picked up a lot of lip products like when i say a lot trust me it's a lot like i just lost control okay i got this viral lip pencil from makeup forever this is the shade limitless brown i think it was Haley bieber who was raving about this lip pencil and almost everyone on the internet talks about these lip pencils so i had to get one for myself and this is the shade limitless brown it's a deeper darker chocolate brown shade it's very creamy and very pigmented as you guys can see and you can use these pencils like on your eyes on your lips as well on your brows so it's a multitasking pencil so i am super duper excited to try it out and the next eye product another lipstick from sephora collection this is the shade which shade are you it french case and i love Sephora Collection Liquid Lipstick Formula. They are pigmented. They are not super duper drying. They last all day long and when they fade, they just leave a beautiful stain behind, which I absolutely love. So here is the shade um, French Kiss. It's a beautiful like bright watermelon red shade and i am into this type of shades lately so i think it's going to be a perfect shade for the spring and summer love that and next i got one lipstick from urban decay this one is in the shade hitchhike like i love the formula of these lipsticks okay i got one during the sale and i just fell in love with the formula so i needed to grab another one so this is their matte formula and this is the shade hitchhike oh it's so pretty it's like my kind of color it's a peachy pinky nude kind of a shade so beautiful like i can see myself wearing this a lot because i like this type of nude shades for my complexions first next i next i picked up these two lip sets from huda beauty and these were like 29 dollars each and what a great value you guys like one lip liner it's for like 21 dollars uh, or like 19 around 19 20 dollars one lip product is around like 
somewhere between 20 to 25 dollars but you are getting two products only for 29 dollars it's such a great value and i had to pick it up so this is the shade 90s lip duo yeah 90s brown lip duo and it's basically their new four filter lip gloss in the shade glassy the clear one and this is their i think pinky brown no warm brown lip liner over here like i have tried huda beauty lip liner a smaller pencil and i never repurchased it i do not know why and what a coincidence like you won't believe i wanted to buy the warm brown lip liner and uh, the pinky brown lip liner from huda beauty during the sephora vib sale and they had those two lip liners in these sets so i just could not pass so here is the lip liner over here warm brown it's a beautiful warm brown shade the name is appropriate i'm not going to swatch the lip gloss because it's a clear lip gloss so there is no point of swatch this is the next uh, set bombshell lip duo and this is the lip liner pinky brown over here again the name is just appropriate it is truly a pinky brown lip liner super excited and look at the lipstick like it's my favorite huda beauty lipstick shade this is a shade bombshell i used to be obsessed with this lipstick and here is the swatch and I hope you can see the Urban Decay one and the Huda Beauty one are pretty similar. Like you can tell I am into this type of nude shades like this warm peachy sort of nude shades because these type of shades they just complement my skin tone so I am super excited to try it out as well. And next I picked up another Huda Beauty product. This is their a new faux filter lip gloss in the shade of Bombshell. Like this shade. It was sold out in no time and I knew it's going to sell out because it is a very popular shade. This shade is so beautiful. It's going to complement so many different skin tone and I think that is probably why it was sold out pretty quickly and yeah here is the shade bombshell it's actually a corresponding shade to the liquid lipstick it's pretty close over here such a beautiful beautiful shade. I have already tried these lip glosses and the formula is to die for they have that soft like pillowy cushiony texture slightly on the thicker side but not goopy or not sticky at all they just give your lips that beautiful glass like shine and you know they fill in all the lips lines your lips just look bigger and fuller and the price point is amazing it's only 19 dollars like for a lip gloss that is a luxury brand and that is for 19 dollars i think it's a really nice step for huda i really appreciate that next i picked up two lip glosses now i am officially a lip gloss junkie at this point i know but i just could not resist i picked up two, two lip glosses from fenty beauty this is their gloss bomb universal luminizer and this is the shade really and then i got this uh, gloss bomb cream in the shade fenty glow let me just show it to you so here's the shade really fresh let's watch it here it's a beautiful like pinky shade and it has got tiny shimmer particles in it though i am not sure if i'm going to like it or not because if you know me you know me i do not like shimmers in my lip glosses especially when i can like feel them between my lips so that's a turn off for me but i have not tried this i am going to try it out for sure and this is the shade fenty glow it is again a beautiful shade my neighbor's dog Stop. this is their cream formula and this is the shade fenty glow what a beautiful like pinky shade it is peachy pink i should say such a beautiful color again i like this type of shades and i am going to definitely keep you posted i love a good lip gloss and i just cannot wait to try all these out and again i'm going to post uh like get ready with me trying new sephora makeup video pretty soon so please stay tuned for that and i think that is it for all the products that i got and yeah i hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and i 
hope this video was helpful for you if you did then please give it a thumbs up and please do subscribe to my channel and if you are not following me on facebook instagram and tiktok then please do follow me there again i am super fun to watch so please do subscribe and yes yeah, you soon in my next video till then bye and take care bye